pride in your weakness or carry it like Jesus or just wonder where the peace is the heart's beautiful the brains where the peace lives Hey what is it guys this is Bills here and today I'm going to be giving you guys another tutorial I think it's been like a couple of months since I've done my last one and I promised tutorials but oh shoot what was that no uh, I promised tutorials but I don't know just uh, I've been really like interested in just doing edits lately so uh, yeah I want to come in here with another tutorial because I got like 10 votes up on that uh, straw poll that I released uh, earlier so yeah we're going to do a tutorial and today I've had so many people ask me this uh, through Skype and they wanted to know how I do my screen pumps and more more importantly they wanted to know how I did uh how I do my like wiggles like I'll, I'll, I'm gonna explain here I'm gonna teach you all of it so here's the thing here I'm just gonna render this pre render this real quick and just show you what we're gonna work with all right do you cry in your weakness or carry it like Jesus or just wonder where the peace is the heart's beautiful the brains would have okay so it's not very much uh it looks really bad but like that's the point I just I only just synced it up but uh, yeah, we're going to be working with this. So first of all, big tip. This is a really big tip. Black bars, really important. If you don't know how to do black bars, then you like it's, it's really simple. Seriously, so just create another uh, video thing. Just create another like video track. All right. So when you oh shoot, I accidentally clicked that. So once you click the video track, you go to. Yeah, there we go. There it is. God damn it, why do I keep doing this? Once you go to video track, go to media generators, go to uh, all the way down to solid color, then go to white and put it over your thing. Okay, and then just stretch it out so it hits like the entire top so you don't have to worry about it later. So there we go, just put that there. And then now it's all white. Here's a fix for that. Just put it up, go here. I would do that way too fast. Go up to this, this green, these two square two green squares compositing mode I don't, I don't know what these are called I just go them by pictures I just go by them by pictures so compositing mode then go to multiply and mask now just letting you know when you're doing this anything that is bottom that anything that's over here that's not up here so like let's say let me just cut this out let's say there's a clip here and then there's there's no white bar over there it's not going to show in the edit and it's not going to show in the preview so just make sure there's a white uh, there's white all over like white on top of your entire edit because then it's gonna show black bars Otherwise, it's not gonna show anything. Okay, so here we go. So we're back here now. We're gonna do black bars So we go to pan crop um, I have these I have a lot of settings. I have like tons of settings Actually, no, I had a lot more before I had to reset my Vegas But I'm just gonna do clip and here's like this here's like just pause the thing if you want to know exactly these settings I would suggest just like um, I would suggest just just mess around with your own settings but here just pause the video and look at these those are the settings all right so I've got it like this and it's just gonna stay like that now hopefully let's see yep see now we have black bars and this is how I like it all right so let's start with oh this is my way all right here we go okay let's start with uh, this one so it starts with him running all right so let's start with the first pump now here we go so this is what I do all right so like my B uh, don't Oh my god, I'm, I'm such a I'm at such loss for words right now. Make sure to start from the very beginning. That's the whole point of a screen pump. Some of these I don't split. The only parts I do split were are parts where I like shoot. So like here's the whole sinking part, and then this is the part where I shoot. This is the only part where I split. Um, it's a whole sinking thing. If you can do it, doesn't. It does, I don't even know why I'm bringing this to you guys, but yeah, we're gonna start with this. So I have so many of these. So we just do we do screen pump. If you don't know, like it's so easy. Just make sure these two are ticked and just go down, and then it'd be a screen pump. I already have settings for it. Just just do whatever you like. So there you go. So it starts over here, and it's it like it's um yeah. It's, I don't know. I'm I'm overcomplicating it. So it starts over here. Go over here. Some people they like to do 10 frames, 15 frames. What I like to do is I just go all the way to the end, all the way to the end, and just be mind. And then I put it at default. But be mindful that this is only one clip if it, if we were doing it to this we don't do it all the way to the end because then we have other you know beats to pump to pump up so there we go we just did one already that took like two minutes all right so let's uh I'm just gonna make sure i'm recording yes i'm recording i think yep all right so we got it this part so we're gonna start pumping this up this is actually extremely simple seriously like i don't, I don't know how i 
was it good at pumping back then so here we go screen pump these are the settings i really suggest you just do it on your own it's actually really simple to make your own settings for screen pumps so i'm just going to zoom in here make sure this is tick by the way this is really important it, it tracks your thing your, your line here and here so yeah just make sure that's pumped i mean make sure that's ticked what am i sake all right so here we go this part's pumped now let's start from here so we got screen pump mode again then we go to here and we put a marker okay and what we do is we go three frames back well for me it's three frames because this song is kind of like deep and slow so the slower the song um the more far back that you want to go if it's a speed song i would suggest going two frames back but it's, it's all in perspective you can just preview render it and then you'll find out so so one two three Okay, let's we'll just do three. Just put it at default. And now, there, now, automatically, you have a pump right here because we put like a. This was like we, we just put the first uh, keyframe right there. Now we have another pump. We drop that adjusted or anything. Unless you want to make this one smaller or bigger, you can just change that. It doesn't matter. Go to the next one. Do the same thing. One, two, three. Then click this. I'm sorry if my computer is really slow. Um, recording audio and video with a crappy laptop it's, just, it's always gonna be like that all right so we got to this part then one two three do the default then go all the way to the end of the clip mm, then we put it back to yeah yeah go all the way to the end of the clip then we put it to default okay so let's just see this part let's see how this looks just mind by that there we go all right Okay, I think I think I might have made the script slow too. In your weakness, I'll carry it like Jesus. Yeah, see. In your weakness, song, I'll carry it like Jesus. In your I, weakness, I really can't tell. I'll carry it like Jesus. In your weakness, I'll carry it. Yeah, okay, yeah. So we're gonna fix a little bit because um, the pumps are way too big on this. So we're just gonna go to small. Oh wait, shoot, no, that's a wrong setting. Uh, actually, let's just move it up a little bit move it up a little bit and then we'll just save it real quick delete after shoot okay there delete after save it oh my phone's going off go to this keyframe then go to delete after i'm just changing it up because this doesn't look nice when it's like really pumping in deep so go there and then do that okay let's now let's look at it in your weakness, I'll carry it like there you go. It looks a lot, not not a lot, but like it looks a little I'll carry better. It like Jesus. Don't worry, it's literally just singing and screen pumping, so it's not gonna look nice right away. Okay, so this part, this is where I put the wiggle in usually, but we're not gonna focus on that right now. We're gonna focus on like we're just gonna fix this. Actually, yeah, we're just gonna fix the rest of this up first. So uh, let me just okay. So this part, I would do. I would do, uh, yeah, I would just do screen pump. Actually, no, it's a cinematic, so I would do a big screen pump. And then, oh, actually, no, oh my God, I can't believe I'm saying this. If you listen to this right now, a big thing, I'm such an idiot for even trying to do this. Never screen pump your cinematics. I don't know why I was just deciding to do this. I'm really stupid. Yeah, never never screen pump your cinematics because that just makes it look bad. I would just, like, use Panacrop to make it look uh farther like there but like never screen puppy cinematics uh, it's, it doesn't look nice okay so yeah we're gonna forget screen pump in that so I, I just put a wiggle on that as well then i guess okay so here we go i got this part let's put this same thing uh delete after no actually no it starts out it's the clip starts out again so we're gonna do big no actually no big is too much we'll do this go to the next one Go put it down, one, two, three. Uh, do this, and then put it all the way to the end. And that should be good, I think. Oh, no, no, this was delete after, it was supposed to be. Okay, then there's another wiggle. All right, here we go. This is like, I don't know, a lot of people asked for the wiggle and how to do it and stuff. So here, I'm gonna just teach you how. Just let me look through this for a second, and then we'll see how it goes. All right, hold up, okay. You cried in your weakness, I'll carry it like Jesus. Or just wonder where the peace is, the heart's beautiful, the brain. Okay. You cried. Alright, here we go. So this is the most important 
like it's one of my favorite effects and I've learned it from I, I, I remember when I didn't know how to use it I used to watch Zant's video and try to figure it out at first I thought it was just pan crop and like really smooth pan cropping but nope it's one effect in my timeline where is it it's right oh, I can't find it where the hell is it I'm so there we go this wait no hold up wait hold on something's wrong here wait oh oh my god i'm such an idiot <laughs> i am the worst tutorial maker ever i'm in media generators jesus oh my god i was looking for this one right here hold up i thought i lost it for a second that was weird here we go this is this is the most important one and already you can tell that i have a lot wait for it to load Already you can tell that I have so many effects for it and yeah because I wanted to master it but the one that I use the most is deer style and um, th these are deer these are deer's, uh, these are deer's presets this is deer's preset not mine um, I do adjust it a few times but um, yeah this, I, I didn't make this all right deer made it so yeah if you want to look at the settings I don't know just, here's the settings just take just pause the video that's that's usually the settings for it okay so once we get to there what we do is we put it at its like at the, at it one five one five zero zero eleven seventy five and yeah the other settings and then we keyframe these two make sure to keyframe this because this it's really important just make sure to keyframe both otherwise it's not going to look good because uh, when you when when we're lowering the amplitude of the s shake then the frequency is still going to be high and it's just going to slowly fade while the frequency is still at 1175 looks terrible just just letting you know okay also normally i would if like i said let's say if i wanted to put s shake on this normally i would just put it from one side to the other like i would put it from like the regular settings and then put it to zero from the end but this one look at that we have another keyframe and then we have another spot so what we do is we, we just it's just it's just simple just put it all the way down and that's that's really pretty much it it's like it's it's a nice effect you gotta like tamper with it though because you don't want to you always want to screen pump with it because it doesn't look nice because it shows like uh shows like the sides of the screen so okay we'll put it there and then okay that's it then let's see we got a screen pump right here okay screen pump bring it to here and we just do the same thing here one two three and then do that one two three oh wait hold up no i'm doing something wrong yeah yeah no i'm supposed to put this to default okay there we go okay so we did that to that and now we're gonna do it to this and we're not gonna we're, uh when you're when you're putting uh wiggle on uh, on cinematics make sure to not have it on default make sure to have it on zoomed in or something like that because it's not going to look good because uh, it's like here I'll, sh I'll try to example it actually no i can't example it like it, it's just going to show the sides of the screen it's not going to look bad it's not going to look good at all so you just got to do that okay and then delete this make this the original zoomed in let's add some s shake to it okay keyframe both of these go to the end since this is only one clip we, we don't have to put it at a certain spot we just got to put it to the end and yeah there, there we go and then i think i might put a shake on this as well now for for music that zant uses he doesn't use deer style deer this is like an aggressive uh shake but um yeah let's see how let's see what this looks like it might not look as good because the s shakes are really aggressive i might have to tone it down a bit okay do you cry in your weakness or carry it like Jesus or just wonder where the peace is the heart's beautiful the brains with okay no that was that was so laggy hold up I just want uh, my computer does this uh, I have to like render it just a few times just to get it to perfectly work do you cry in your weakness or carry it like Jesus or just wonder where the peace is the heart's beautiful the brains with yeah so yeah it's aggressive I like how it is on uh, like the part Jesus. where he shoots or just like, that looks nice or carry it like Jesus. Or but just these are aggressive. Okay, so I'm just gonna put a. I'm just gonna change it to a mild shake. So it would be. So here's a setting for mild shake. I actually made this one. This one was my own. Mild shake. This is this is just. I I just like kept it 
at 150 and then just turn down the frequency and that that just uh changes uh the pace for it and then this one will go to mild shake as well uh okay mild shake okay there we go let's now let's see it okay just I just gotta render it pre render it a few times. Do you cry in your weakness or carry it like Jesus? Or just wonder where the peace is? The heart's beautiful, the brains with a beast lit. Yeah, it needs a lot of work though. But yeah, that's, that's basically it. That's basically how Wiggle and Pancrop works. Well, no, well, not in how it works. This is how I do it. Um, hold on. I might have to like. Maybe it's a little too much. Sometimes if it's a little too much, if there's too much of a gap between two for, uh, two markers, then just, just bring it up a little bit. Just to make sure it doesn't like freak out on you. If there if there's like a if you have if you have a slow song and the gap is like from here to here, then it's kind of it's it's not really smart idea to have S shake and start from here and then end it over here. It's, it's not gonna look good. So okay, I should really put that keyframe back where it was. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna move it a little bit. And it doesn't it's it's near from perfect. Um, when you look at the final product in the beginning of the video, it's gonna look it's gonna look different, but this is this is basically we're just we're just right now the the, the edit's been synced the edit's been screen pumped and the uh, and there's just a few wiggles weakness, that's really it or carry it like jesus or there's a lot more effects that goes on this. yeah i don't know what's wrong with this i think it's because i'm recording or something but it should look a lot better yeah okay okay maybe i need to make the wiggle a lot more powerful in here yeah no no wonder see this is what i was talking about it looks really weird because I didn't have, I didn't, sc I didn't screen pump this. Yeah, this is exactly. There we go. It should look a lot better now. Default. Just look. Let's look through this part. I just wonder where the piece is. The heart's beautiful. The brain. I just wonder where the piece is. Yeah. The heart's beautiful. The brain. Yeah, but there's so much this uh, this edit's missing. And I'm just gonna add them while I'm just I'm just gonna add them after this tutorial. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. I have so I have like a lot of effects that I try. Like I, I I don't know. I went through I went through a lot of these effects. There's like tons of effects I haven't even tried yet still. But uh, yeah, if you guys want to see another tutorial, then let me know. Leave a like, comment below, I and I really really hope you enjoyed. I know this is this is like a terrible tutorial because I messed up on a few things like meter generators looking for s shake but yeah i'm just i'm just starting out on it i anyway, either way i hope you guys enjoyed you guys learned how to screen pump and uh s shake the bills way it's actually really simple and um it, yeah it looks really generic is because i didn't really because i tweak around with my uh i tweak around with my uh screen pumps it doesn't always look like that it looks really generic this way just just tweak around with it just mess around with it you can't always you got to be your own editor you know you got to be your own editor Sorry, I had to cut that part out because I was just messing up way too much at the end. Uh, just the outro pretty much. So, yeah, um, yeah. like I said before, I really did mess up a lot. Uh, not not a lot, but like a little bit. In uh, I'm not the best tutorial maker. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. And if you guys want tutorials, just tell me in the comments below. It's been your boy Bill. So see you later. Peace.